Hello! And welcome! Spitchum! To Fire Red! Randomized! I may not be able to catch anything. These Pokemon are too weak. My Pokemon are too high level. I just got down from Mount Moon. But I've still got gas in the tank. Hiker Franklin would like to battle. The Pikachu! Hiker is sending out Pikachu. Alright. Not using Thunder Shock. That's weird. I mean Am I weak to that? I don't I don't actually know. Cause I'm like a rock electric type or something. I don't think rock types are resistant or immune to um, electric. I think it's the ground type uh, matchup that most of them are that makes them immune to it. Like Geodude and Onyx. Which is uh, also four times weakness to water, so that hurts. Pretty bad. You worked hard. Local trainers come here to practice. Oh, I thought I'd get a double battle out of that one. Youngster Joey! Alas, poor Youngster Joey. You do not have a Rattata. Super effective. But oh, Diglett used Magnitude! Oh dear, Magnitude 7. Super effective, even though it barely did anything. I will use Absorb, thank you very much. Yay, experience. But send out Jigglypuff. Sad. Does not have a Rattata. I wonder if he has a Rattata in um, the. Uh, the official Fire Red version. I don't know. Oh well. Thanks to Joey! You're decent! What, no quips about your Rattata being top percentage? That took me to a great party on the SSN at Vermilion City. Thanks to Dan. Snuck Rhymer. Not a favorable matchup. I think dark types are weak to poison, if I remember right. So let's use ready instead. Doesn't ever seems like it does much. Sorry for the yawns. It has been a long day. And I am recording yet. 3.30 in the morning. Usually I'm in bed by now the last couple weeks. I'm gonna see Bill first. We battle. Hiker Wayne sends out Gloom. So it looks like we're gonna be doing a lot of battling in these next few episodes here. Both the previous one and this one, and possibly even the next one. Before we really get into, like, you know, continuing the plot. But hey, that's not too bad. Sweet scent. Evasiveness spell. Critical hit. Super effective. Nice. Here's something. I certainly am. Hi, my boyfriend is cool. Pignaker Kelsey.
<sighs> Jeez. I'm really sorry for the yawning people. I also apologize for not exactly the most entertaining right now. <laughs> I just... I'm not like Game Grumps. I don't know how to just come up with like things to say. Like I don't know how they do it. I really don't. You know? I've tried before to just come up with anything. And I just can never think of anything to say. So, it's like I don't know what to talk about really, you know? Like what, what is, what's interesting to talk about, you know? Give me a topic and I might use it in a later episode. There you go, there's a thing you can comment with. <laughs> Dragon Rage! Yes! Give it a leer. We're in Dragon Rage! Vinegar Kelsey. My conditioning isn't the best. For a second, I thought she said her conditioner wasn't the best. I was like, what does the shampoo that you use have to do with anything right now? Oh, uh, I suppose it's conditioner, not shampoo, but we'll have to see a Pokemaniac's collection at the cave. Why are you just standing there? Hiker Knob. His name is Knob. Body Slam! Dozer. Yay! Cubone! I will keep out uh, Lapry for that one. Because what a gun! That is super effective. Cuba! Send in Horsey. Alright. I still don't have anything good to use against water types. I need to get like an electric type or something. I mean, I have Radicate here, who has Thunder, but... Thunder is such an unpredictable move. I am tapping way too hard on my controller right now. <laughs> nice! Powerhouse of the team! You done got me, and real good, too! I want you to come down. What a cool guy. I've got a girlfriend. I want him to come down so I get that item ball that's behind him. Camper Flint. Send out Subat. Go Lapry. What a gun. Nice. Not bad. Use Diglett. Alright, look at Bell Lapry for that. What a gun! Super effective. Yay! Aw oh, darn! I wonder if a lot of the the fact that Game Grumps like manage to come up with topics all the time comes from the fact that there's two of them. Like, having a second person really helps with commentary, you know. Because when one person doesn't know what to say, usually the other person does know something to say. So I wonder if the fact that the Game Grumps have two people really helps out in them coming up with, like, random things to talk about and such. I mean, I don't know for sure, but still. I just hope I'm entertaining enough for people. I mean, 
I've seen that like Rhino Fox watches a lot of my vi videos, so I guess it must be entertaining enough for um, him. <laughs> I don't actually know Rhino Fox's gender, as I just suddenly realized. I think male, but I don't know. Hey, Rhino Fox, leave a comment. <laughs> Let me know. Find as many cute Pokemon. I'm so jealous. I suppose I could just refer to Rhino Fox as they, since I don't know what their gender is at the moment. So. Slowpoke is paralyzed! Oh, right, because of Body Slam. I was like, why? What did I do to it? <laughs> no, I remember that that was from Body Slam. Body Slam has a 30% chance? Of paralyzation, I think it is. So that's pretty decent. Let's use Dragon Rage. Voltarb. I just used Thunder Wave. Oops. Well, that's alright. It was paralyzed, so. Dragon Rage! Wiped out. <laughs> I remember the uh, the one Pokemon episode where um, uh, um, James gets a uh, Magikarp and he kicks it into the water and it evolves into Gyarados and it uses Dragon Rage. That was hilarious. Magnitude 5! It's super effective. I don't actually know why magnitude is super effective. I don't know what type magnitude is. <coughs> I just kind of suddenly realized I didn't know. I don't know a lot about Pokemon, actually. There's a lot of things I don't know, much to my surprise. You guys trainers? Hello. Are you here alone? You're out at Zelda and Cape. Well, it should be as a couple. The Cape is a famous date spot. Missy's gym leader has high hopes about this place. It seems like I remember in first gen them saying something about, um... Uh... If you take a date there, something g really good is supposed to happen. Hiya, I'm Pokemon. No, I'm not. Call me Bill. I'm True Blue Pokemaniac. Hey, I'm with that skeptical look. I'm not Josh and you, lady. I screwed up an experiment and got combined with a Pokemon. How about it? Help me out here. Wait till I get inside the teleporter. When I do, go to my PC and run the cell separation system. What happened to the Clefairy that he got combined with? Three initiated teleporter cell, cell separator. Yay! But seriously, what happens to that Clefairy? Yeah! Thanks, lady. I owe you one. So, did you come see my Pokemon collection? You didn't? That's a bummer. Yeah, oh, thank you. Oh, here, maybe this'll do. Yay, we got the SS ticket! The cruise ship SSN is in Vermilion City. And there are lots of trainers on board too. They invited me to their party, but I can't stand fancy dues. Why don't you go instead of me? Go on and have a good time. Yay! Out to route back out to Route 25. And we'll just run back to Cerulean City now. Um, I think this is a good spot to end it here, though. Uh, next episode, we'll go face that uh, Team Rocket member. Um, so if you've been enjoying, feel free to subscribe. Feel free to leave a like. And I will see you funny next time. Keep calm and pony on, everybody. <laughs>